Yeah, what up, Detroit? Nuh uh, nuh uh, no, he didn't. Uh -huh. They didn't do it again. What's happening, everybody? This is your boy Smitty from DetroitMapsRoom.com, ready to give you my review on the Detroit Lions win over Seattle Seahawks 28 to 24. It wasn't far off. I predicted 24 to 23, but hey, Lions got the victory. Can't take anything from it. A lot of the keys that I mentioned in the pregame came into play. Um, they didn't contain Marshawn Lynch the way I thought they would. They gave up one big play, which kind of put them behind the eight ball a little bit. But, I mean, that's the defense. They kind of bend, don't break. They broke on that play and a couple other touchdowns. Really didn't hurt them that much. But, you know, the offense wasn't, you know, speedy out the gate. But they played better in the first half. They moved the chains down the field. They didn't settle for field goals when they got into the red zone. Joint Bell and Michael LaShore looked okay. But the biggest story of today's game was, of course, Titus Young. He came to play, second-year wide receiver, taken in the second round. Him and Broyles put together some plays which completed the Lions today. Calvin Johnson, I don't know what's going on with him. He's dropping a lot of passes. He was a decoy early, but let's just be honest. Matthew Stafford played a little bit better. He looked a lot more comfortable. The tight ends caught balls. They didn't have any turnovers outside of the interception by Stafford, but he looked a whole lot better. Still a little bit too close for me. Like I said, if they don't give up the big play to Marshawn Lynch, I think the defense has a very solid game. They did have penalties early. You know, that's still a little bit of a concern as far as Jim Schwartz and what he's got to do to get these guys more discipline. And I'm not taking anything away from the win. To get better as a football team, you can't have as many penalties as the Lions keep having. They helped out. Seattle in one drive I think it was the whole drive was 57 yards and the Lions had 41 yards and penalties from that so clean that up and you get more production out of your defense Green Bay and Chicago both won today so that doesn't help um, I know it's, it's kind of drinking the Kool-Aid thinking that the Lions are just going to come back and get into this race but let's just be honest take it one week at a time Let's take care of Jacksonville next week, get this W on the road, get back to 500, and we'll let the chips fall where they may. Shout out to all the cyber bullies that's just talking smack on YouTube, whether you're a, a Seattle fan and all these fans, all these other teams. You got something to say? Say it to me on Twitter, Smitty DMR. Come holler at me on DMR Radio. You want to talk smack? We can go mano y mano. Let's do it. You know, you scared? Okay, say you scared, but don't be leaving the little cute comments at the bottom of the YouTube video. Until then, again, I'm Smitty from DetroitMazzle.com. Make sure y'all check out the website, follow us on Twitter, like the Facebook fan page, and subscribe to this YouTube channel. I'll holler at y'all.